Well, Brady's gone mad. Anyways, what's happening Friday? We're having our test Friday, right? That means uh, that's remember that's your biggest grade of the nine weeks so far. It can really help you. It can also do the other way. Um, I want you to be ready for it. So when we review on Thursday, Thursday, which just happens to be a, a special day of potentially Rady visiting our class. You never know. You never know. Well, anyways, um, yes, take that test seriously, unlike Rady in the background here. He's going crazy. All right. I put in a bunch of grades. You got your updated grade sheets. Today, you'll have time to work on missing work, corrections yesterday's assignment and the quiz from Friday if you got a low grade you can correct it yesterday we learned how to write a word problem in standard form right what is standard form I'm glad you asked. ax plus by equals c right the x and the y are on the same side and it equals some constant c some total okay that's different than what we did on the 17th standard uh, slope intercept form so maybe tomorrow we'll get some mixed practice but for today we're just working on finishing that assignment missing work makeup work correction work get, get right after this warm-up so let's read it jerry jones sells popcorn for five bucks and hamburgers for seven bucks i should say dollars right five dollars for popcorn seven dollars for hamburgers how many items is that two items right hamburgers popcorn when there's two items Standard form. So we need to find our X. So popcorn is going to be X. Hamburgers is going to be Y. And what's our total? Well, Mr. G wants to spend $30 on popcorn and hamburgers. So 30 bucks, $30 is going to equal. And then we're going to have our AX plus BY. We're going to have X popcorn is 5 bucks. So remember, you put the value in front of the variable, $5 for each X popcorn, plus the value in front of the variable, $7 for Y popcorn. Sorry, uh, Y hamburgers. So again, five per popcorn, seven per hamburger. That's it, that's standard form, okay? Now, if it's multiple choice, you're probably gonna see it flipped around like this, five X plus seven Y. Okay. This is not like solvable per se uh, without some additional information, and we'll do that when we talk about uh, systems of equations. But for now, that's all I asked you to do yesterday. That's all I'm asking you to do today. I didn't even see that. All right, so what are we doing now? Finish yesterday's assignment. Makeup work, <laughs> work, and if you need to correct a quiz, I need you to do that first. Without talking about it, without using your phones, please, I'll come to you. All right, here.